everyone welcome to good mental health today i'm going to talk about how to stop overthinking so there happens that sometimes at some point of time in life we do overthink a lot right there are certain situations we want to get out of our head but it it bothers us so badly that we are unable to do that so but then that if we won't really work on it that is going to multiply and this multiplication of thought can create a lot of jumble in our life and can distress us badly so let's learn what we can do the number one thing is practice present awareness present moment awareness what you can do in this you need to use a technique of mindfulness when you will practice awareness that will allow you that will help you to stay in the positive uh, uh, to stay in the present moment and will make you positive and control your thoughts too so pra- uh, practicing awareness is that very important thing that will allow you to focus on to the present and will not lead you uh, to another stage of uh, multiple thoughts so you have to stop your thoughts you have to control them use the mindfulness technique and that is how you can do that the next one is practice acceptance when anything is bothering you whatever the thought is coming into your mind which is not so good and that is creating creating a circle of negativity you have to practice acceptance accept that thought and just tell yourself that let it be you can deal with it once you will accept it you will get the power to deal with it to understand it and to really find out the ways how you can do it when you will accept it you are training your brain to find out solutions and to work on it and you will you have to do it in a positive way and the next one is nothing lasts forever in this world so you need to understand that nothing lasts forever and so does uh, our thoughts right why because it is the universal law of nature universal law of nature that nothing can last forever so when any thought is entering in your mind this is for a certain time period so when you will tell your brain that it's just for some time you can really act upon it you can help, take the control back and start thinking something good for what you can do to really really you know kick that thought out of mind you have to do it really sooner so that it should not cross a limit and should not put you in any kind of a stress so keep this thing into your mind that nothing lasts last forever and so your thoughts cannot be there for longer time so do not entertain them for a longer time do not give any space or room in your brain to them right and the next one is observation of mind that's an important trick so do the observation of mind that everyone should do in their daily life every time right and especially when you are in a state of chaos when you think that something is out of your control so what you can do in that is that you can definitely uh, be in an observation mode where you can check your thought patterns what you are thinking why you are thinking is it giving you something good in life or how you can really uh you know do certain changes in life and is is it worth thinking too much so this is how you can observe and list down things that is coming into your mind so observation is quite important for reaching to a solution and reaching to a point that if it is really uh, important that that we are entertaining this thought so how you can do that now that's the point so how you can do is you can just uh, self uh, use self, positive self talk and you can even listen to your inner self listen to your uh, self more than uh, anything else L- watch out your thought patterns and try to use a technique wherein you listen more and talk less right that's how you can get into the mode of observation next one is use reframing methodology that helps a lot and can really do a lot of wonders in your life right when you try out this strategy in your life there's uh, there there are a lot of chances you can resolve many issues in your life what you can do in reframing is you have to reframe each and every negative thought that is coming into your life because if you won't reframe it what will happen is 
that thought is going to be uh, there in your brain for a longer time and that can create a lot of stress right you don't have to multiply your thoughts you don't have to entertain them for a longer time use the reframing trick here you can journal it down that's the easiest way can help you out you pen down your thoughts and in front of any negative thought write down a positive statement immediately when you will cut down the negative statement and enter a positive thought right there that is actually entering in your brain too so this is a trick and that is how you can uh, you know stop overthinking and this can help you out a lot and the last one is practice gratitude so this is uh, a very important trick wherein as much you will practice to pay gratitude there are number of number of chances that you will get to uh, pay your gratitude more and more in that uh, in maybe 5 minutes a day sit down somewhere just list down things you are grateful for each day develop this practice and when you will uh, you know practice paying gratitude that will help you to stop overthinking that will help you to shift your focus from a nonsense thought to thinking something better in life this will allow you to uh, you know think something positive instead so when we focus on to think something positive in life that will help us to stop overthink and that will help us to control our brain too so this is how we can stop over overthinking and uh, i hope you love this thank you for watching see you next time